Bo. Um, looked like uh, there was a lot of frustration out there, especially with the amount of time you were getting to set to, set to throw. I mean, did you feel like you were just kind of running for your life out there a lot tonight? Uh, no, I thought the – I mean, overall the game was, was very fast, and I thought they did a really good job of, um, I mean, having a great plan for us, and they were really good defense, and we knew they were going to bring some pressure. And uh, part of that's on me. I didn't slide the right way, didn't get it protected. Um, and then I just got to get the ball out when the guys are running open. Next is Jason Caldwell. Well, how tough was it to, to really to, to, be, to find yourself in a hole and have to, to kind of abandon the run game there and just kind of throw it? How, how tough did that make it tonight? Uh, well, anytime you find yourself down 21 points, um, really that quickly in the game is not, not a good way to start. And, um, I mean, we just tried to come out in the second half and throw, throw all our bu bullets at them and, um, and we throw the ball around a little bit. And we had some successful drives, and then we just stalled. Brian Matthews with a question. Yeah, Bo, thank you for speaking to us on what was a tough night for you guys. Um, how tough is it to really do anything on offense to execute when – you know, you sort of, uh, Gus talked about y'all getting beat up at the line of scrimmage pretty good. How, how tough does that make your execution? Yes, sir, no problem. I appreciate it. But, um, I mean, it's tough. Georgia was a really good team. And we knew they were going to be a good team coming in. We knew we were going to have to play really good. And um, they played about just as good as they could play. And we played about as worse as we could play. And it, it showed on, on, the, on the field. And, um, I mean, we just got beat. And um, that's really all you can say about it. Thank you. Question Thank you. from Jeff Centel. Bo, again, man, thanks for your time. I think Coach Melzon gave a lot of credit to the opponent tonight. I'm interested in your context tonight. That was a good unit last year, Georgia, and then you faced them this week with a good plan. How is this unit better? I know they're older, a lot of guys back. How is this unit better than the one you attacked last year? Uh, I just think – I mean, I think that's what it is. I think they all had a bunch of returners, and they all had a year under their belt. And so – um, if you give, I mean, a good team, good players, a year to kind of continue to develop, they're just going to be better than what they were last year. And I thought, um, I mean, they had a really good plan for us. They came and they played hard, and that's all that um, was really a difference in the game. And they just played harder than we did, and um, it showed. Thank you. Steve Moulton. Hey, Bo. Appreciate the time. Um, and it felt like – especially when you were trying to get your rhythm out there. There were some critical drops at, at times at which that it felt like the, the offense could have kept, yeah, kicked it into another gear. So I, I'm wondering if I could get a thought of that, I, of critical drops at critical times tonight. Uh, well, you know, I made some pitiful throws and some uh, missed a bunch of guys out there tonight. And I'm never going to blame a receiver. I thought they were doing the best they could, and they were going up and getting it. Seth had two close ones. Um, I mean, that were bang, bang plays at any other time that he makes. And, um, I mean, I'm never going to pin it on him. And I mean, drops are part of the game. And, um, I mean, I miss more throws than they had drops. So that's unacceptable from my part. Where do you think you guys need to improve the most moving forward? Uh, just at quarterback play. I think um, he needs to do a better job um, kind of moving the offense, being a better leader, and uh, completing passes when they're there. Question from Jeff Shear. Oh, JJ Pagese gave you a, a spark there in short yardage. What did you see from him in the Wildcat? Yeah, he's a great young talent and a really good player, really athletic, really big, strong, physical guy. And um, I mean, he can do it all. He runs down on kickoff. He protects for a kickoff return. Um, so the, the guy can do it all. And um, he's a good weapon for us. Follow up from Jason Caldwell. Oh, you know how tough it is to play as a freshman. What did you see out of Tank and, and, and kind of the, what he delivered and brought for you guys tonight? You know, that was the best part of the night, I think, uh, just watching him play. and I mean, that guy's a fighter. I've never seen really anything like it. Um, he just competed his butt off. And, um, I mean, he was a spark there when we needed one. And he kept us, I mean, kept us ahead. Uh, he made some huge plays there um, over and over and over. And he's the one that kind of kept us rolling. And so – um, really pleased with what we saw out of him. Um, now we just got to get everybody playing like Tank. We have time for one or two more. If anybody has one, post in the chat.
guess that's it, Bo. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you all. I appreciate it.